Is your Windows 11 PC continuously staying at 100% disk usage? This slows down your PC and if this stays for long, it could even damage your hard disk. In this video, we will see how to fix 100% disk usage in Windows 11 PC. Identify the cause of high disk usage. The first thing you should do is to check the cause of the high disk usage on your Windows 11 PC. Right click on the start menu and select task manager. Then here on the process tab, click on the disk tab to sort the process with high disk usage. Now the processes that are continuously using your disk will appear on the top. If there is any third party app or program that you installed that is causing the high disk usage, you can select it and click on end task. If that program is still causing the issue, try to update the program or uninstall it. However, if any system process is causing high disk usage, this won't work. You will need to follow the fixes that I am about to discuss. Disable SysMain or Superfitch services. SysMain is a Windows service earlier known as Superfetch. It is designed to load the programs into the memory before you launch them. Its main purpose is to quickly launch applications on your Windows PC, but sometimes it entangles with other programs and keeps loading programs from disk to memory. That results in a high disk usage. So we will disable the sys main service. Press Windows plus R button. Type services.msc and hit enter button. Now here locate sys main or superfetch service. Double click on it. Here change the startup type to disabled. Then click on the stop button. Now click apply and ok. You will see that the disk usage has gone down drastically. If not, follow the next step. Disable Windows Search Windows Search continuously looks for files and folders to prepare the index, which you can use to find the files quickly. So it is also a suspect for high disk usage. We will see how to disable it and see if the problem is fixed. But note that it could affect the file and folder search operation. So we will try to temporarily disable the windows search. Press windows plus R button. Type services.msc and then hit enter button. Now here locate the windows search. Double click on it to open. Then click on stop. Now check if your disk usage goes down. If yes, then windows search is the culprit. You should change the startup type to disabled from automatic. However, if disabling the windows search doesn't do anything to your disk usage, you should start the windows search and follow the next fixes. Restart your PC in safe mode. Restarting the PC fixes several windows problems. If normal restarting isn't doing anything to your disk usage, you should try to boot your PC in safe mode. Sometimes it does wonders. To boot in safe mode, press windows plus R button, type msconfig and hit enter button. Then here visit the boot tab. Here select the save boot option and click OK. Now restart your PC. The PC will boot in safe mode. Now disable the safe mode as you have enabled it and restart your PC in normal mode. Then check if the 100% disk usage is fixed or not. Disable MSI mode. Microsoft reported that in some cases, the advanced host controller interface PCI Express causes high disk usage due to firmware incompatibility. So if you disable the message signaled interrupt mode, the disk usage can reduce drastically. We will first check if your PC is in MSI mode. To do that, press Windows plus R button, type devmgmt.msc and hit enter. You will see the device manager. Now expand the IDE ATA ATA API controllers. Right click on this entry and select properties. Go to the drivers tab and click on driver details. If you see the path ending with star ahci.sys then you can proceed with the next step. If you see any other driver name appearing here, this step is not for you. It won't help you in reducing high disk usage. So you can skip to the next fixes from here. Otherwise. Close this window. Click on the details tab. Change the property to devices instances path. Right click on the value and choose copy. 
Open a notepad file and paste the value in it. We will need it ahead. Now close the device manager. Press Windows plus R button, type REG edit. Press enter button. Now navigate through H key local machine system, current control set, enum and then expand PCI. Now open the notepad where you pasted the value. Match it here and then expand the value. Now expand the subkey. Now further expand the device parameters, interrupt management and then select signal interrupt properties. Now on the right side, double click on MSI supported. Now change the value from 1 to 0 and click OK. Close the registry editor, restart your PC, you will see that disk usage is going down drastically. Disable connected user experience and telemetry. Connected user experience and telemetry runs under svchost.exe. Sometimes it also causes high disk usage. So we will disable it and see. Press Windows plus R button, type services.msc and hit enter. Now locate connected user experience and telemetry. Double click on it to open. Change the startup type to disabled. Click on the stop button to stop the services immediately. Click apply and OK. You should also disable the connected devices platform services. It could also cause high disk usage. Use the same steps to disable it. Disable scheduled defragmentation. Windows 11 performs defragmentation periodically of your hard disk to improve performance. However, it also causes high disk usage. So let's disable it and see if the disk usage improves. Click on the start menu, type defragment, click on it. Now select any volume of your hard drive. Click on the change settings. Now untick the run on schedule, click OK. Disable startup apps. The apps that start with your system keep running in the background. They could also cause high disk usage. So let's disable them. Right click on your start button and select task manager. Go to the startup tab. Now carefully observe each app here. You should disable the apps that don't need to run whenever your system starts. Right click on them and select disable. Run check disk. Your hard disk builds bad sectors or logical errors with time. With such errors, your disk usage could hype. So we will run a check disk to see if your disk is intact. Click on the start menu, type CMD. Right click on it and select run as administrator. Click yes in the UAC. Now type chkdsk space slash r space c colon where c is your current system drive. When you hit enter, it will ask that the volume is in use. Do you want to schedule the check disk at the next startup? Here type y for yes and hit enter. Now restart your PC. The check disk tool will scan your disk. Reset virtual memory. Press windows plus r button, type sys dm.cpl and hit enter. You will see the system properties. Click on the advanced tab. Then here click on the setting under the performance section. Then again select the advanced tab here. Then click on the change here. Now untick automatically manage paging the file size for all drives. Now select custom size. Here in the initial size enter 1906 MB. Then in the maximum size enter 1.5 times of your current RAM in megabytes. For example, if your RAM is 8 gigabytes, then we will multiply it by 1024 to convert it into megabytes. Then here we will again multiply it with 1.5. It comes to 12288 MB. So we will enter it in the maximum size. Then we will click on set. Then click OK. Restart your PC and you will see the disk usage has reduced. Check settings in Google Chrome. Google Chrome has an inbuilt feature that preloads the pages for faster browsing. Sometimes it keeps loading the pages which results in high disk usage. So we will disable this setting in Google Chrome. Open your Chrome browser, click on the menu button and open settings. Now go to the privacy and security section. Then click on the cookies and other site data. Scroll down, you will see preload pages. Click on it. Then select no preloading here. Now you will see your disk usage has gone down. 
Now you will see that your disk usage has gone down. Scan your PC for malware. If your PC has malware infection, you will see high disk usage. So you should run the scan and make sure that there is no malware infection on your PC. If you have installed any third party anti malware, use them to scan your complete PC. Otherwise, you can use Windows Defender offline scanner. It is pretty good at detecting stubborn malware. To run it, click on the start menu, search for Windows security, click on virus and threat protection. Then here, click on scan options. Select Microsoft Defender Antivirus Offline Scan. Then click on Scan Now. Then restart your device and offline scan will check your device for malware. Clean install Windows 11. If your issue is still not resolved after following all the fixes, the last resort for you is to do a clean installation of Windows 11. As it has been seen, the people who have upgraded from Windows 10, their disk usage is usually high. So if that's the case, so you should download the media creation tool for Windows 11 and then do a clean installation. You should also consider upgrading to SSD. They are a lot faster and high disk usage issue is not common with these. So you should consider upgrading your hard disk drive to solid state drive. And you will see that your PC is much faster and disk usage also goes down. That's it for this video. If you have any questions or suggestions, drop them below and share this useful video with your friends and family. Like the video and subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to press the bell button to receive alerts for videos on Windows tips and tricks.